We did it, boys and girls. We finally hit the two thousand subscriber mark so this video is kind of just a thank you video for all you supporters out there each and every single one of you made this happen now i was kind of structuring what i could do for you guys since hitting 2000 is a, definitely a big number for me so i wanted to reward you guys with how much money or revenue or ad revenue that i've been making on this channel so I was starting to put together numbers and screenshots and everything. So I want to make sure everything's like correct and posted correctly because I don't want to do any disclose, any non-disclosure things that I should do. I got to look into legal stuff to make sure I'm not showing too much. Um, but I think it would be really interesting because you could really see how much I grew. It'll definitely be a video for like smaller YouTubers and creators and motivation to really get into this type of industry. It really is incredible. Um, so I think exposing the revenue I'm making now, now it's not like I'm gonna be retiring from a job tomorrow, uh, but it could definitely come to that in the future. Um, so I think that's why a lot of people love to get into YouTube because you can do something that you're passionate about and really get compensated for it so if anything this is a motivational video just because i if if you guys have smaller channels if you guys have no channels whatsoever i was in the same boat as well i started out with zero just like every other person and i'll give go into a little bit of history now um i started out i'm normally it doesn't seem like it but i'm a quiet person so i'd be like the last person you'd expect to be talking on YouTube. So I'm like, th it would be amazing to help people in the world. Like it could be anywhere across the world. I might not ever meet them, but I could still help people out because no one really helped me out financially because no one knows this stuff. No one talks about it. No one teaches it. So I'm like, Hey, maybe I could try. And it, it was a while until I got rolling. I remember it, it It was a long time, but I was sitting at like nine subscribers for a long while. And I'm like, come on, I need, I can't even get two digits. Come on, 10 subscribers. And I finally did. And then someone else subscribed. I'm like, come on. So then after a while, I finally got to the three figures of 100. And I thought that was incredible. Then the next year I hit a thousand. That was even more incredible. And my goal for this year was actually 2000. And I hit that three months beforehand. Um, so my new goal is hopefully getting 2500. I'm like one person away as of right now of 2100. So I think we could push the 25 mark by the end of the year. Um, but like seriously don't let anyone else dictate what you do that was one of the main factors that why i delayed starting my channel and i don't want it to be yours as well if you worry about other people's thoughts other people's feelings like what are my friends gonna think what are my family gonna think what you know you're putting yourself out to the world like you're letting people judge you and that's not that's not fun you know, that's, that's terrifying. But when we suck it up and realizing that, listen, this is my life, this is my decision, I'm gonna rock it. And when you finally do, it's just, I don't know, it's just amazing because not many people do it. So when you do, you definitely stand out. And just keep going for it. Keep staying motivated and dedicated. I don't care how many videos you have to put out. You know, I have hundreds and I just hit 2000. Yes, I am a smaller growing channel, but like you, you could probably grow faster than me, but you should seriously always strive for bigger and better. And just life is amazing. You could do anything you really want. And yes, this is a little bit of a ranting video, but it doesn't matter because it's my channel. Ha <laughs> ha, because like that's the other thing you could really do whatever you want. Um, and you know, I might be weird about it. I might be crazy sometimes. I might be awkward sometimes. That's just how I am. 
and over time you get more comfortable with it and then you just go for it so for you smaller channels or whoever didn't start it yet highly 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 recommend it and like i said before guys i am planning on setting up a video to show you how much i actually made uh because and by the way apparently they don't send like checks anymore like i wanted to have my first check out i wanted to show you guys i want to put it on the wall for like ever um but it's all electronic now i did screen capture it so that's cool uh, but i want to go into that how much ad revenue we're getting monthly now we're actually getting paid like it's crazy. I never like I, I thought that like hey getting paid from YouTube that'd be amazing. I might not ever get there, but that's a cool thought. Well we're living it right now. So you know each and every single one of you made it happen. So I want to state that this is a community. If you ever want to leave a comment, I always say that at the end of my videos, but if you really want to, by all means leave it. If you have suggestions. I take requests. I'll do a video if you guys want. And it's, I want to be as open as possible. That's one of the main things that I told myself that I want to do for you guys. You know, I could like lie about things to make it like, I don't know, like a clickbait type of thing or to get it out there and, you know, whatever. But that then just destroys my reputation. And I want to be open or as open as I can. Um, which is usually pretty open unless like legal stuff gets in the way but like I usually tell you guys everything and that's what I want to do with the next video so I'm kind of just going on with this I didn't script any of this at all but I guess I'll throw out some shout outs right now so I guess the one main channel that really got me started with nothing financial you know guys I talk about money all the time it was actually Alpha M. If you ever heard of him, he's a great guy, Aaron Marino. Uh, he got me into, I, I was never like a fashionable person, but I learned from him that you could be confident in how you just portray yourself and how you dress and you just, you build your self esteem. And when I did that, I was able to do videos like this. Because before, I, I was definitely not, I didn't want anyone looking at me. I wanted to be under the radar, and that's it. But once I learned a lot from him, then it kind of just grew from that. Um, but some other financial channels that I watch regularly and that helped me out, I think one of the first was Financial Education with Jeremy. That, I, I remember he was like around like 10,000 subscribers. And it turned me off at first just because like, oh, he's not like a huge YouTuber for whatever reason. That's what I thought at that time. But I continued watching. I'm like, you know what? He kind of knows what he's talking about. So I continued watching and now he's over, I don't know what he's at at this point. Definitely over like quarter of a million subscribers. Right now, Graham Stephan just crushed a million subscribers. Then you have a bunch of others like Ryan Scribner, which I worked with like years ago. That was interesting, but uh, that kind of faded by the wayside. But that was cool to work with him for a little bit. Um, then there's like Nate O'Brien is great. Whiteboard Finance is another one. He just recently took off, which is fantastic. Um, meet Kevin. He's a nut, but he's great. And uh, one of the smaller channels, Money Life TV. He Mike, Mike, this guy. He always <laughs> leaves a wacky comment, but he's a great person he's a cpa so any of these channels definitely recommend you could check them out there's probably a bunch of other channels that i'm not mentioning but i want to thank each and every one of you guys and just like love each other <laughs> like there's way too much hate out there and i'm ranting on i don't care i'm i hit my 2000 this is my video <laughs> and um but it, it really is crazy what you can create. Uh, one more shout out that I would recommend for really anyone. And it's more mindfulness. His name is Prince E. There was a couple videos that I kind of mentioned him because he has great ideas. He's kind of, I wouldn't say a motivational speaker. But he's like, 
an enlightener, not like a religious person, but he's definitely uh, an intellectual human being. So I definitely recommend checking him out. A lot of great topics. So many great YouTubers out there. But again, this is just more evidence of why you can create YouTube channels of anything that you possibly want. And I highly recommend it. So I'm going to start wrapping up. I know I'm ranting on, but that's okay. Uh, again, if you guys have any like suggestions of what you would like me to talk about, by all means, I'll do that for you. I want this to be a community of people that actually care about each other. And by the way, if you like this type of video, kind of more like just... I wouldn't say straight to the point because this is not straight to the point. But if you want it like kind of more, I don't know, real, um, definitely let me know. Because sometimes I do do like jump takes because that it, it just makes it a little bit more interesting. Kind of gets more to the point. I'm able to think throughout the video instead of just throwing stuff out there. But there, there's also value in these types of things as well. You kind of learn a little bit more about me. I usually don't go too much into my history so if you want that by all means i love to do that um so again thank you so much 2000 are you kidding me i thought like a i thought 10 was incredible and we just i don't know what that is like a twenty thousand percent increase um but again guys thank you so much if you have any questions comments concerns please leave them down below i really love to hear what you guys have to say i can't thank you enough it's amazing that we got to this point and if if you love like these videos don't forget to hit the bell icon i never talk about the bell icon i maybe did it like once uh, but it lets you know when i put out videos i did rearrange that it used to say monday wednesday um i just changed that it's tuesday thursdays now i'm trying to stick with that schedule just because i like to work during the week um so like right now it's monday night and it's going to be posted for tuesday night and um so we're going to stick with that schedule for now if things change i'll let you know and i think that's this is kind of just a bunch of information at once uh, but hopefully it is valuable you can look at it through like it's just motivational and inspirational hopefully you know i see a lot of videos out there that helped me out and if this could help like one other person out that would be pretty awesome i feel like i already helped at least one other person out you know through the you i'm ranting on i don't care i through my youtube analytics you know when i see other countries viewing this channel that's like insane i thought it was like cool to you know talk to someone in a state next to me now i'm talking to like countries next to me and you know don't really focus on the views that you're getting when you think of it realistically and this is kind of what helped me in the beginning because if you're a beginner expect absolutely nothing it took me like over a year maybe two to really get rolling but even if you have like three views that's like a group of people that's pretty cool like a group of people are listening to you if you have like 10 people or 20 that's a classroom size a hundred people is an auditorium one of my most recent videos just blew up. It's still rolling very nicely of over 6,000 people viewed the video. That's like a stadium. That terrifies me to think about. And like when you think of it that way, it's actually a lot more interesting because each view is an actual person. It's just not a number. And I realize that each and every single one of you guys is a person and I want to treat you like that I'm not gonna to try to scam you like some other financial advisors out there I want to help you I'm not saying I'm a financial advisor do your own research legal disclosure um, but I'll wrap it up now guys thank you so much for watching greatly appreciate it and I'll see you in the next one